Today guys, our today's topic is about oil TBN and water content testing. So let's go! Before we start, what is TBN? TBN means total base number. This is a property that measures oil's ability to neutralize acids formed during engine operation. So where do acids in our engine operation came from? The answer is from the fuel oil we use for our engines. TBN is expressed as MgKOH slash G or milligrams of potassium hydroxide per grams. How about water? Water and acid produces the same effect. They cause corrosion to the engine parts. That's why they should be monitored from time to time to lessen the damage on our engines. Let's take first an sample of oil in the auto backwash as shown in this picture. Put a tray or any kind of materials that will collect your sample like this one I used to do. And then loosen the plug to collect your sample. This will be enough for your testing. This is what we use in our vessel. The brand is Drumarine and it is from Japan. The Drumarine is known for the reliability and durability. That is why the company issued this to us. This is called Regen TBN that we will use in our testing. And this is the device that we will use in testing our oil TBM. Press the power on and this is what you will see on the display of the device. Choose the TBM30 when you are testing the generator system oil. Pour some TBM reagent on the beaker so that you will not contaminate the TBM reagent on the container. That will be enough for the whole testing. Press the next on the device, another next, and you will see the procedures on the testing. As you can see in instruction, it says there that it needs region TBN to lower line, 5 ml of oil, and place the lid. 8.5 milliliters of region TBN. Pour on the lid. 5 ml of sample oil, pour to the lid, and place the lid, then shake it vigorously. After 130 seconds of shaking, we got this result 26 total base number. The generator system oil should not be more than 30 mg of potassium hydroxide per grams, and not less than 20 mg of potassium hydroxide per grams. This is based from the company safety management system. Next is the water content testing. Still, we use drum marine device to measure our water content in our oil. Choose the range from 0.02 to 1%. Press next. Press 2 for H2O paste. And you can see the procedures and requirements for the testing. Test solvent, H2O paste, agitator, open the lid, pour test solvent to the beaker, 10 ml of test solvent, pour to the lid, another 10 ml, and pour to the lid. Put the H2O paste. 5 ml of oil sample, put the agitator, and place the lid. Press next and wait for 5 seconds. Then shake it vigorously. After 180 seconds, we got less than 0.02% of 
of water content in our oil. Based on our sheet, the maximum water content should not be more than 0.20% of water. It means we passed the qualification for our GE system oil. That's it guys for today's topic about the uh, oil TPN and water testing. I hope you learned something else. If yes, please like, share, and subscribe, and click the notification bell. Have a safe voyage, and see you in my next vlog. Bye!